parenting is not for the weak. <sighs> Even the punishment is not working anymore. The go and stand in the corner, go to your room, collecting the phone, it's not working anymore. And I don't know what to do. I don't want to turn into that parent that will always use force. Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. <laughs> I don't understand why I'll be sweating this much in the morning. When the sun is not out. If you are seeing my face for the first time, my name is Denny Aloha and you are most definitely welcome back to the channel. In this channel, I share my motherhood experience and if it is something you are interested in, don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to like and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, okay? So today we have our women anniversary program today in church and I might not be able to capture the process of getting ready and all of that because we are absolutely late at this point. <laughs> woke up quite late but i am very sure i'll be able to give you some clips that's why i'm doing this introductory part so in case those clips find their way into this vlog it will not look strange you'll not be asking yourself what's going on here <laughs> in my church there's something called relief society which is the women aspect let's say the women women group let me put it that way because some people might not understand when i say Relief Society organization. So today is our anniversary, 187th anniversary, and we are having a little program just to celebrate. So that's where I am headed today. Let me go and beat. I'm already sweating. I'll see you later. Okay, bye. <laughs> something eh? I said I will share it with you people so recently my daughter just clocked three years old and hmm, I just want to say that what they say about the terrible tools is nothing compared to what you are going to face when these children clock three years okay since she clocked three years my husband and I have been worried like the things that used to work before they don't work anymore you will tell her to sit down or don't do something and she will look you dead in the eyes and say no no matter how many times you repeat yourself the answer is no 
I don't know. I don't know what to do at this point. I say I will bring it out here so that those who have toddlers, if you can relate with me, please tell me how do you parent this Gen Alpha? They are the Gen Alpha. They are not Gen Zs. How are you parenting your toddlers? How are you doing it? Because it's hard. Okay, it's hard for me. They said the parenting they did for us, the normal African parenting damaged us, right? <laughs> so we are trying to correct our footsteps. We don't want to parent like our parents. We don't want to be the typical African parents. But then it is hard. It is hard because tell me why I will have to repeat myself a hundred times. Tell me why you will just intentionally choose to be naughty. I cannot shout. Because if I shout now, they say I'm traumatizing the child. So, like, it's tough. I can't lie. Sometimes I used to shout. <laughs> Sometimes I used to scream and shout. Then later I feel guilty about it. The bad thing about shouting or raising your voice at these kids is that for my three year old, if I raise my voice at her, she tells me I'm raising my voice. She'll be like, Mama, you are shouting. And she focuses on the shouts like I'm shouting I'm raising my voice but she will not focus on why I am shouting I don't know if you understand I'm raising my voice because I've repeated that same thing to you like three four times that's why I'm raising my voice parenting is not for the week oh. they tell us eh, the baby stage is the hardest I want to tell you today that the baby stage is enjoyment if you have any child that is zero to one you don't know how much you are enjoying because when they clock two three hmm, they will show you pepper i don't know whether whether a particular switch just used to turn off or turn on in their head and so please share with me in the comment section how are you parenting your toddlers parents of more than one toddler it's only one i have and i am already complaining those who have four toddlers under five because I know people that have four children that five years. How are you dealing with it? Because even the punishment is not working anymore. The go and stand in the corner, go to your room, collecting the phone, it's not working anymore. And I don't know what to do. I don't want to turn into that parent that will always use force, raise their voice all the time if I want to correct her, smacking or hitting or beating i don't want to be that kind of parent but at the same time these toddlers will test you they will test you man i just need help <laughs> what works for you how do you discipline your toddlers how do you make them take correction because right here we are struggling that's just what i wanted to say thank you so much for sticking with me to this part i am just trying my best to maintain this until i put to bed so that i can relax it because i am not about to be doing natural gang i don't have the strength thank you so much for watching thank you for sticking by me to this point do not forget to subscribe do not forget to like do not forget to drop a comment okay if you end up liking my content i will see you in my next video bye